thousand meters and they sprinting away Rosara and Rose for Trippy could have been better away. Big eyed girl busts along on the wide outside. Silver Winter likewise. Bold Act shows a lot of pace. She's right there on the rail. No more than a length and a half behind the leader as Silver Winter slides on by. Wings of Nike. Black sleeves and check. Cap cold hard stare. There she goes. Races three quarters of the way back with Rosara a further length and behind. And Rose for Trippy is racing around five lengths off the leader. They make their way to the top of the straight with 500 metres left to run. Silver Winter brings them in over Big Eyed Girl. Wings of Nike at their outside. Bold Act. Rose for Trippy got a clear run under the outside rail then comes Rosar in the orange there she goes and cold hard stare but with 300 meters left to run Rose for Trippy's been unwinding but Boldak nagging away big eyed girl there she goes and wings of Nike all trying to come out of the pack with Rosara two off the inside Boldak though continues to lead cold hard stare lunging late but it's Boldak to a last Boldak the winner second cold hard stare then came wings of Nike fourth got close Rosara and there she goes involved so the winner is bang in the middle, the uh, purple and lilac colours. And she came out running, which was a surprise, but ultimately half the battle won. Cold Hard Stare was doing some good work late. Rosara likewise, Wings of Nike was always on the premises. But Bold Acts will cause a minor result, not as big as the last two, but a result all the same. Number two, Bold X has come through for Mr. Tombs and his colours here for the feature race this afternoon. Well done to Mike de Kock and, of course, uh, Olsen, who's excused himself from the interview, and Summy Hill Stud Bread. Now, Craig, uh, yeah, I think you were quite confident about this one. I wish you'd told me, but uh, nice win. Thanks, Lyle. Yeah, um, last time I rode it was the first time I rode it and caught a field in the blinkers. And, I mean, I was ch tracking Supreme Crest in the 14, and even though she's one two over the trip, um, Supreme Crest couldn't go good enough for me to pull me through and I had to show a daylight early and she, she has a very short running and she just didn't get that last furlong. So straight afterwards I asked Mr. Lecoq please bring her back to the sprint, uh, sprint and I'll get her back to winning ways and um, I, I would have preferred a 12 but today's pace she showed um, really caught me by surprise and um, I think this is a nice confidence booster and this just opens a few more doors for her. Yeah, well, and two nice double on the card. You're riding well, and uh, lovely to have you home. Thanks, Lyle. I can't do it without all the support. Um, all credit to Mark, Alson, Vengi, Mr. Lecoq, um, Aunt Diane, and just everyone involved. They do, they do all the hard work. They put in all the hours, and I'm just in a position where I'm getting some good support for them, and long may I continue. Thank you. Thank you. Well done to Mr. Day Toombs. You said earlier this week you'd like to chat to you more often, so yeah. <laughs> trying to make that happen. <laughs> well done. And to my sponsors, <laughs> Maurice Fantine, Bochum Buschiff. Thanks, guys. Thanks, Craig. Lovely double so far. Mr. Day Toombs, I literally did. I said to him, let's speak to you. Please come in, sir. I said, please, let's speak to you uh, more often. And here we go. How about that? Uh, yeah, that's lucky week. Eh? Yeah, very lucky. lucky week. Yeah. I've got to say that in the box, Anthony said to me, he fancied the horse today. I, we didn't, I didn't have that much confidence. Craig was confident. But really a big thanks to the whole team back in Mark's stable, back to all Mickey Goss's days as well, to thank him. So mm. it's been a, and you know, I did support Active War quite a lot. So it's been a good, uh, it was a good decision for me to do that. It was easy though, because mm. he was on the farm. So <laughs> anyway, thanks very much. That's and it's, it's nice to see uh, her coming back to a bit of form and um, she won't stop here. Yeah? Well, I hope so. You know, she, would, she looked like she'd be a good horse when she was yes. younger. She ran a good race in Durban the one time to rain in Holland. Uh, but four-time winner is not easy to get a four-time winner. That's so, true. you know, hopefully she can win another race or two and maybe get some small black top because that's what really counts in the whole thing. Well, let's, get these, let's keep these interviews going. Well done. Thanks a lot, Lyle. Thank Mr. you. Mr. Day Toombs, an absolute pleasure. Okay, Mike. Thank you, Mike. Uh, please uh, come in here. Other, speaking of Michael, Michael's going to come and accept uh, the groom's prize here. Michael, um, yeah, the sources are nice to see you, her winning again. Yeah, thank you very much. And, uh, of course, the stable, you work for a very powerful stable, so, um, yeah, it must be a, a nice but pressurised job. Yes, <laughs> they're doing very well, both of them. All right, well, congratulations. Here's that cheque for one and a half thousand rands. Thank you for accepting it, Michael. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. One and a half thousand rand for the uh, winning groom. Michael will be handing that over. And thanks so much, as usual, to World Sports Betting. Right, so I'm just going to uh, stand slightly closer to the trophy here. Michael, just behind Michael. Um, so this is the Henneman Trophy. Theoretically, this is the biggest race on the card. And we've got uh, Spike and uh, Karen and uh, Lynette who are representing the uh, Faree stable. So 
Um, lovely to have them here on course. This is the families, of course, of the uh, Henneman disaster. And Spike, I wonder if the ladies couldn't just stand next to the trophy. We don't have to talk. Just come and stand next to the trophy. These, of course, the uh, the family of the, the, the Furie family. And here we go. Lovely to have you ladies on course. And um, just to show you that beautiful trophy. And gone but not forgotten. And lovely to have you here. Thank you so much. All right. So there we go. That is uh, race number seven. The numbers you need here. Two, seven, eight, and six.